God's peace be with you. Welcome to our devotional for Thursday, August 6th. Today's devotional, like yesterday, is based on Psalm 86, verses 11 to 17. Teach me your way, O Lord, that I may walk in your truth. Give me an undivided heart to revere your name. I give thanks to you, O Lord, my God, with my whole heart, and I will glorify your name forever. For great is your steadfast love toward me. You have delivered my soul from the depths of Sheol. O God, the insolent rise up against me. A band of ruffians seeks my life and they do not set you before them. But you, O Lord, are God, merciful and gracious, slow to anger and abounding in steadfast love and faithfulness. Turn to me and be gracious to me. Give your strength to my servant. Save the child of your serving girl. Show me a sign of your favor, so that those who hate me may see it and be put to shame. Because you, Lord, have helped me and comforted me. So today's devotional from Daily Feast, if I can find it, was written by Herbert Anderson. There is no hint of self-sufficiency here. The life of faith is constantly receiving and letting go, never holding or possessing. We look to God for strength and not to ourselves. The request for strength is a countercultural word because it acknowledges our neediness before God, who is merciful and gracious, abounding in steadfast love and faithfulness. And Anderson leaves us with this question today. What in this psalm and re this reflection do you most need to hear and wrestle with this day? Let us pray. God, for your mercy, your gracious care, your faithfulness to your people, and your love that has always surrounded me, I am indeed grateful. Amen. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord's face shine on you with grace and with mercy. May the Lord look upon you with favor and give you peace. Amen. Thank you for joining me today. I hope you join me tomorrow again. And until then, stay safe, stay healthy, keep washing your hands, practicing social distancing, and wear a mask in public. God bless.